measuring devices. A lot of different ways from liquid all the way to dry, and we're here to break them all down just for you. So we're gonna start here with the 2,000 milliliter or the two liter measuring pitcher. You can see here it has this nice handle on it with a little spout on the end for easy pouring. It's gonna go all the way from 2,000 milliliters at the highest, or just down to 200 milliliters. Next we have the one liter measuring pitcher. This is gonna be 1,000 milliliters or one liter all the way down to 100 milliliters. You can see here it's the same as the 2000, it's going to have the nice handle as well as the little spout at the end. This is going to be the Good Grips Measuring Cup. This one's extremely cool because it has the nice rubber handle on it, but also has, as you can see by our previous videos and by this one, you can see that it's going to have the different measurements down the inside. The numbers are also written in red and very bright for those of you who have, do not see very well. Next here we have the One Pint Measuring Mug. This one is really cool because it has different measurements on it. It's gonna have everything from pints, to ounces, to cups, to milliliters. You can see here it goes all the way up to 500 milliliters, all the way down to 20. And it also has two spouts on each end for easy pouring. This one is definitely the Monster Garden's favorite right here. This is the Big Shot Shot Glass. This one is definitely our favorite because it has all the different measurements on it. You might know based on your liquids that you're reading, some are teaspoons, some are tablespoons, some are milliliters. This one's gonna give you all those, all those easy to read measurements on the same exact glass. Tablespoons, teaspoons, ounces, cups, milliliters, and it even gives you drinks in case you wanna party with your friends on the weekend. This right here is the graduated measuring cup. This one is a two cup or a 16 ounce measuring cup and it's graduated, as you can see, it goes down at a slight angle. It has the handle on it and the nice, easy to pour spout. Makes for really easy pouring into your reservoir. This one goes all the way from two ounces or a quarter cup, all the way up to 16 ounces and two cups. A little bit smaller version. This is the Measure Master graduated measuring cup. It's an eight ounce or one cup. And it also has milliliters all the way from 25 milliliters to 250 milliliters. Similar to this style, just a little smaller for the micro gardener or just maybe simply the more concentrated nutrients that only use a small milliliter per gallon ratio. Definitely the smallest of, of the ones that still have the handle is gonna be the Hydro Farm 250 milliliter measuring device. This one is very similar to this style in that it has the handle on the side with the spout but it's much smaller as you can see. So those of you out there that have highly concentrated nutrients, or maybe you're just a micro gardener, this is gonna be a good device for you because it's gonna be very similar to the big shot glass that's gonna have all the different measuring on it, except it's in a smaller size. It doesn't have the drinks on it, however, but it does have the teaspoons, tablespoons, ounces, and milliliters. It goes all the way down from five milliliters all the way up to 30 milliliters. That is the one ounce shot glass for measuring. So for those of you that are doing extremely small measurements, this one probably looks familiar to you. You might have seen it in, say, a high school or a college chemistry class. This one's pretty cool in that it's gonna top out at three milliliters, but it even has all the way down to 0.5 milliliters. So this is gonna be important for those of you that are doing pesticides or fungicides, as well as, again, extremely concentrated nutrients, but you're just not using a very big batch or a very big reservoir. This is a good tool for you. So this is gonna be a demonstration of how the syringe works. What you're gonna do is you're gonna simply put the syringe needle or the syringe end into the solution and just simply pull until you have your desired amount of liquid reached. So for just for example purposes, I'll go to the maximum and I'll go to 100 milliliters. But you can see here, it does a very good job at holding the pressure so you're not losing any liquid when you transfer it to your reservoir and just simply just push it back down. Now you can also, you can tell here that there is still a little bit of residual liquid left in the syringe. So unless you plan on cleaning the syringe from one product to the next as you go down your nutrient line. So here at Monster Gardens, unless you plan on cleaning the syringe after every use between each component of your nutrient line, we recommend you to have a separate syringe for every component of your nutrient program. So this one right here is really cool for those of you gardeners that use water soluble nutrients. This is known as the Measure Master Spoon. Now you can see here that there's different ratios. There's gonna be a quarter teaspoon, half teaspoon, one teaspoon, and one tablespoon ratio. So if you can see here, 
Each one of these is gonna pump 30 milliliters or one ounce of nutrient solution. The cool thing about these products is they're really versatile. So the gallon size you can see fits on, fits on any standard gallon size bottle. This one right here is for a two and a half size bottle. However, you can see by this display that we were able to find an extremely concentrated liter bottle that had the same size lid. So these two, these two dispensers are gonna dispense 30 milliliters of nutrient solution or one ounce of nutrient solution for each pump. With one single pump, you're gonna get 30 milliliters. Wow, that stuff's thick. You can see 30 milliliters of nutrient solution. And the same thing goes for the gallon size bottle. Thank you for watching this video and checking out all the different ways that you can measure your liquid and dry nutrients. These products as well as over 4,000 gardening products are available at monstergardens.com. Please use the link at the bottom of the video screen.